What's good, everybody? It's your boy, Sir House of J. Yeah, yes. Back again with another tutorial. And um, this time we have another classic. This one is from the Love Jones soundtrack. You probably remember if you're a fan of that movie. And Love Jones is actually one of my favorite movies. So I uh, definitely remember this um, tune. And um, it's called Hopeless by Dion Ferris. Uh, and I'd like to give a shout out to Fletcher Ruffin uh, for sending in the donation and sponsoring this tutorial. Thank you so much. If my memory serves me correct, Dion Ferris used to be a part of that group. Uh, what was it called? Take me to another place. Take me to another land. What was the name of that group? Dun, 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 dun. Arrested Development. If I'm not mistaken, she used to be a member of that group. And then, you know, she started doing some solo stuff. So this is uh, this is a nice tune. Not too hard either. So we're in the key of E. Right? E, F sharp, G sharp, A, B, C sharp, D sharp, E. All right? So we're going to start with, sorry. Okay, you're going to do that sequence like at least four different times. So let's break that sequence down. So what this is, is this is an E suspended fourth. You can do E, B, E on your left hand, B, E, A on your right hand. And all you're doing is taking this A on your right hand and bringing it down to G sharp. So you're like, uh, uh. I mean, you can play the rest of the chord again on your right hand. But the only note that's switching is this. Uh, uh, that's all you're doing. Uh, uh, okay. And then your left hand will continue to stay on the E. And your right hand is going to do. It's going to do. Right. Which one is it supposed to be? Yeah, like that. Okay. So what's going to happen is, okay, again, your left hand is still E, B, E. Your right hand is going to be B major. So this is a B major over E. B, D sharp. F sharp and then you're going to take your pinky from this F sharp and move it to G sharp which in theory turns it into an E major 7 chord but um, it's also how, how did I write it it's a B6 chord I wrote it as a B6 chord over E okay but it's also an E major 7 but on the chord sheet I said B6 over E alright and then you got your, so that first chord is a G major over D, double D on the left hand. You can put that A in there if you want. Right hand, B, D, G. So you got, then your next chord is, I wrote it as an A6 chord over C sharp, okay? So that's double C sharp on your left hand, A, C sharp, and F sharp on your right hand, also known as the F sharp minor seven over C sharp. But for me, it's easier for me to get the right um, uh, inversion, the right inversion. I, I have to tell my, in my mind, I have to think of A6 chord and just remember to put it over C sharp, okay? And then you're just going to go down to an A major chord. This is a regular A major chord. Double A on the left hand. A, C sharp, E. Okay, so you're going to do those cycle of chords at least four times for the intro. And then once you start singing, you're going to keep going. I don't remember the words. <laughs> and then, um, and then you got your little pre-course right here. You see, uh, okay. So those, uh, what's that? Yeah, just four chords. Um, you're gonna do a G sharp minor seven, double G sharp on your left hand, G sharp. B, 
D sharp, F sharp on the right hand. Sorry, then you're going to go to a C sharp 7, not minor 7. I accidentally just played that just now, but no, we don't want minor 7. We just want C sharp dominant 7. Double C sharp on your left hand, G sharp, B, and F on the right hand. Then you're going to go to F sharp minor 7, F sharp, C sharp, F sharp on the left hand, A, C sharp, E on the right hand. And then you, your left hand is just going to go down to B. And you have an A over B chord. Double B on your left hand and then an A major on the right hand. A, C sharp, B. You can always add this F sharp and make it an F sharp minor 7 over B. You know what I'm saying? It still gives you that same effect and it's an extra note in there to give you a little bit more richness. So if you want to make it F sharp minor 7 over B, feel free. Okay? So now you're on the chorus. They say I'm hopeless. Then like a penny in a hole in it. Been up in my head in it. Whatever the words are. <laughs> so all that is is a F sharp minor seven, F sharp, C sharp, F sharp on the left hand, A, C sharp, E on the right hand. Then you're gonna go to a B major at nine, double B on the left hand, and on the right hand you have B, C sharp, D sharp, and F sharp on your right hand. And all you're going to do real quick, your left hand stays on the B. Your right hand will quickly just hit the C sharp minor chord, which is just C sharp, E, G sharp. If you want to play this B again, that's fine. That's that make, that's still a C sharp minor 7, because if you put that B right here, there you go, C sharp minor 7. So whichever one you want to do, I think I usually do the C sharp minor 7, so I, this is what I usually do. B, C sharp, E, G sharp. And it's over B. So C sharp minor 7 over B. And then come right back to your B add 9 chord again. So it's like, uh, 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 like that. So they say I'm hopeless. Like a, like a penny with a hole in it. Okay, you're going to do those chords like four, four different rounds. So... They say I'm lawless. Whatever the words are. <laughs> Been up in my head. In it. Sorry, and now you're going to go to ba 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 ba. So that first one is an E, a dominant seven chord, E7. E, B, E on the left hand. B, D, G sharp on the right hand. Then your next chord is a D9 chord, but the way I wrote it on a sheet for, that makes it easier for me is I wrote F sharp diminished 7 over D. So you got your double D on your left hand, and then you have F sharp, A, C, E on your right hand. All right, also known as a D9 chord, but just know on my chord sheet I wrote. F sharp diminished 7 over D. Then you're going to do B minor over G. B minor, uh, well, yeah, B minor 7 over G, which is also known as a G uh, major 7, well, major 9. But on my chord sheet, I wrote B minor 7 over G. So double G on the left hand. Right hand is A, B, D, and F sharp. Okay, and then you're going to go down to uh, F sharp dominant seven, not minor seven, but dominant seven. F sharp, C sharp, F sharp on the left hand. A sharp, C sharp, E sharp on the right hand. Then you're going to drop down to a F major seven. 
F and C on your left hand. F, A, C, E on your right hand. And then you got your F sharp minor seven over B. B on your left hand, F sharp, A, C sharp, and E. So those are all the chords to the song. There's no other chords that you need to know to the song. So let's start Let's start with that E7 chord. Well, let's do the whole chorus. They say I'm hopeless. Sorry about that. Mm. Need to pay attention to what I'm supposed to play. Da, uh, uh. Like a penny with a hole in it. They say I'm no Been up in my head in it. And you go back to And then you go to that pre-course Stay just a little too long and Now it's time to be the They say I'm hopeless song i guess you can get ended on the f major seven chord or you I get, yeah it's, you sound kind of suspended if you leave it on there but you can always go to the e major chord to end it how about that so <laughs> yeah, you can do the f sharp i um, know the f major seven and then just go to oh that's the seven my bad <laughs> there we go how about that just a regular e major chord <laughs> E, B, E on the left hand, G sharp, B, E on the right hand. Or it sound, it did sound kind of, it's, it's like I know it, it kind of just, you know, you, you want to kind of hear another chord, but that's kind of a cool way of ending it too with the F major 7. But that's up to you. I think on the recording, it's either this one, the F major 7, or it's the F sharp minor 7 over B. And then the song, that's it, it just stops. So it's either one of those chords. All you got to do is just listen to it to figure that one out. All right, that was fun, man. I, I really like that song. I enjoyed learning it. And um, so y'all have fun playing it. And I'll catch y'all on the next one. Peace.